in the world of telecommunications, timing is of the essence. Synchronization Synchronism is once again a hot topic in telecommunications, but, this time, it comes with a twist, aligning the phase to the standard second. If you think you know everything about synchronization, think again, and join the discussion. In this series we will introduce the basic concepts of frequency, phase, and time synchronization. Then, work our way up to the current techniques, applications, testing, challenges, and solutions. Frequency Frequency distribution is perhaps the most common type of synchronization. It is used in point-to-point -point communication links, so the far end has the right clock, with the same frequency, to identify the proper position of each incoming bit. Without errors. PDH, SDH and SONET are good examples for frequency synchronization. The phase between the master reference and the local clocks can be different. That was not a problem in the past. Since the frequencies are synchronized, whatever phase difference there is, shall not change over time. Some may say, that this is not a true form of synchronization, so it is sometimes referred as syntonization, just like a TV, or radio, can tune to a specific frequency, to recognize and play a song correctly. But, don't you find it annoying, when you are watching the game on TV, and, you can hear your neighbor celebrating the outcome of a goal kick, but, the player in your TV has not kicked the ball yet. Something seems to be missing. In this analogy, the problem is, that timing is not aligned. Frequency synchronization has worked well for point-to-point -point links, with dedicated physical connections. But, that may not be enough for modern and future communications. Timing and Phase Phase alignment or timing synchronization may be new to many people, but, going forward, it could be the most important of all. Imagine an orchestra. All musicians could be playing from the same sheet music, or score. They could also be playing the notes, or chords, with the same tempo. But, they may still, be out of sync, and sound terrible. In this analogy, the sheet of music represents the information or data, and the tempo is the rate at which such information is being delivered. In communications, that would be the data rate, which is tightly related to frequency. As you can hear, frequency syntonization is not enough, when there are more than one element involved. Here is when conductors come into play. They provide timing signals, to align all the musicians, so they play the notes in perfect sync. Which sounds much better. For us, it would be like, having a common timing signal, to align the phase of different types of clocks, even if their frequencies are different. Please note that, to maintain phase alignment, all frequencies must be exact multiples. The good news is, that they are all multiples of 1 Hz. As in 1 pulse per second. In communications, the timing signal is provided by the 1 pps, or 1 pulse per second clock signal. It works like a metronome, to tell every network element, when each second starts, so they can align their real-time clocks. The rising edge of each 1 pps pulse is used to align the phase of all clock pulses around the world. When we talk about phase alignment, meaning that all the pulses raise at the same time, no matter where they are, we are also talking about timing. So let's say that timing and phase are the same. Any error in the signal phase produces timing and time errors. Time Now that every node knows when a second starts, all they need is an asynchronous message indicating what time it was when the 1 pps raised. Such message is delivered shortly after the timing pulse. The arrival of the time label doesn't need to be precise, because the time accuracy is driven by the physical pulses, not by the time messages. By now, you should have a general idea of the relationship between frequency, phase, and time. This was just a brief introduction, of what this series is all about. Introducing, the 10-Minute Expert Series.
VX 10-minute expert tutorials focus on covering complete topics, addressing current technologies, and condensed and short videos for busy people. Subscribe to VX YouTube channel to have access to the latest material. Thank you for watching VX. Domo Arigato, Mr. Robota. Domo Arigato, Mr. Robota. Is that what you guys think of me? <laughs>